Hey guys, um, I'm coming on with um, to share with you what I've made for uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Challenge um, over at Best Scrapbook Room. Uh, I've had these made and sitting for a while now, but I haven't been to the post office to mail them yet, so uh, I'll just show you. I was watching Tina Kappa, hi Tina, and uh, she had bought uh, this scissors. I don't have it out right now. Sorry. She bought this Flip It Sizzix, um card thing back a while ago. And when I had went to um, to my doctor's appointment, one day one of the many doctor's appointments, I uh, ran in real quick to Michael's and used my coupon and bought it. And I love it. It's so much fun. And it's so easy to do. And these are some of the um, images that I've been coloring up. Well, I've been sick. So I made um, three of those. And I put Fight Like a Girl on there. And then on the back, my stamp. But, um, so I made those for Beth. And then um, I made, uh, I haven't made jewelry in for so, so long. But I made these, uh, all these earrings for, and I made their, um, a lot of them are, let's see, those are the same, those are the same. These are a little different. Hopefully there's not, you'll see those. And then, um, there's these. They have the little roses in there. <coughs> and then these are a little bit different. So I made all of those for uh, for Beth and Pam Grammy Two Bay. If you're watching, um, hang in there a minute. I need to I need to, I'll say something to you at the end. But um, then I made um, oh, I can get them up here. I made a couple of the folio albums. I need to put some glue in there and stick it back down good. Um, I made these folio albums. And this is when I realized that I had very little pink left when I went to make these albums. I was like, oh no, what am I going to do? Um, I went through all of my loose, loose scrapbook papers. You know, those papers that, well, me, myself, I have, but some reason I rarely ever use them and I don't know why um, it's not really that I'm hoarding them I just a paper pad seems so much easier so I had to pull some variety of different company brands to make these but uh, I printed off uh, fight like a girl on the front and then I took and I have a, this punch and so I punched several of these um, ribbons out in the pale pink and then embossed the very top one to where it would add some dimension um, on there and this is glittered up I know that this is Cane Company paper here and then um, well that's irritating me I ran that through my Xyron machine and it's not wanting to stick over there it's wanting to pop back up and then these little um, these little things are uh, from these that I got at Tuesday morning. I don't know the tiles, and they're dimensional. And then on the edge, I used um, I put a a uh, eyelid in there and used some of this uh, ribbon that I found for 15 cents at the thrift store. So I put that there. So anyway, on the inside, then um, I did buy this paper right here, this stripe paper, because um, I had another idea in mind when I bought it, and I'll kind of show you, I'll show you that in a minute, but um, the pocket, and then there's several tags down in here um, that I put for the recipient, and then 
the waterfall and I left it very plain very easy for somebody to use and not very you know so it's not intimidating for the recipient oh and then I have put another little ribbon on the inside there so I made um, I made two of those as well two of those as well and then I made oops I dropped some cards out of one of them tags out of this one sorry oh those two are identical except for this one I had put, in, put a heart doily in there that actually came from one of the best kits that was the only different <coughs> okay this was my original idea when I bought uh, that's the striped paper right here. I also got some of this chalkboard, um, a little pad of this chalkboard paper. And then I used this glitter paper right here, and this is the glitter one that comes off. Um, but I had cut that out, that shape out, and did the same thing with stacking the um, ribbon that I punched and glued together and then embossed and then I put one of my little color, colored up gorgeous girls on here there's the uh, the binding and then um, who was it I saw did this Kimmy B 09 hi Kimmy if you're watching she probably don't watch she used to follow me on my blog, but anyway, I had seen she had made uh, one that was similar to this, and uh, there wasn't a tutorial, so I just, this is kind of my own measurements, but it's something that I saw her do, so it's not my own design, but it's my own, well, sort of, my own, my own take of what and she saw somebody else do it. Y'all know how that is. But anyway, this is it. And again, I had to just pull like all of my loose papers. These are all the pinks that I had left uh, of things. And same thing on this one. I mean, so anyway. Um, this little heart down here. These are actually those body tattoo or body sticker sticker thingies that Michaels was selling and that's all I could find at my Michaels that had the little um, breast cancer awareness uh, ribbons on it so there's a tag over here and then this this opens up and it's got there's a tag here front and back at the top hopefully I'm in frame here <laughs> I'll get back down in there. Don't be so hateful. Okay, and then it opens up like this. And again, it's plain. And these, these little tabs right here, they don't pull out or anything. They're just to where the recipient can write something on them. You know, personalize it any way that they want. Each one, I won't pull them all out, but each one has a tag that pulls out. And so that goes like that. And then in the back. But the thing of it is is it also and there's no way that I can get it in frame see how it comes out like this ta -da. Ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. to where you see that to where it's like that and then goes back in and holds back up plain and simple not not a lot of um, Foo foo and stuff going on, and I guess I intentionally left it um, blank to where the pictures could be the main focus and it wouldn't be intimidating for the recipient. So there's that that I made as well. Now, Pam, Grammy Tubay. I made, um, even though I made these for Beth, I know that Beth wouldn't mind. I know that you have your breast cancer awareness thing going on, and I had planned on making you some of these as well um, already just hadn't even told you but um, if you um, would like for me to and if you're still taking stuff
I'd like to send you um, a couple of pair of these earrings. And you had mentioned something about, um, you had asked me on these these folios where you had seen my video, which I hadn't responded yet, I'm sorry, um, if I was selling them. No, I had made I had made these for um, Christmas gifts. However, since I haven't been able to make you um, one specifically for this, you said that you wouldn't care if it didn't have, like, you know, if it wasn't specifically designed for breast cancer awareness, um, if you, you know, that you could sell those too. And so, um, would you like for me to send you this one um, to put in your, because this is one of them that I had made and showed in the video. I'd like to send it to you if you want me to, if you think you can sell it. Um, it has, it's the one that has the most pink on it to kind of still go with the thing but not be directly breast cancer. And it's the one that has the, the uh, ribbon on the back and the doily that wraps around with the little butterfly, of course. And on the inside is the one that has all this pretty rosette trim and all. So, anyway, let me know, Pam, on that. And uh, I hope you all like my uh, the things that I've made. And hopefully I'll uh, get out and get them in the mail to Beth tomorrow. Everybody have a good day. That's it for me on videos today. I'm, I'm worn out and I'm getting tired. I need to go back to bed. I'll see you later. Bye.